look at our new couch. I think it looks really good. And then my mom bought a new TV too. But that's not really for me to use. Well, if I use the couch, I can. But I'm always in my room. But this is another unboxing video. It's been maybe two weeks or two and a half back at this stupid location. But if you remember, my tripod is broken. So, uh, but this is fine, I guess. It's a little bit too high up. Um, or maybe it's not. Maybe it's good. Anyway, I have a lot of stuff to unbox here. Um, if you can see them all in frame. Um, because, well, um, I mean, I, I, I got this one I got first. This way is basically nothing. So it's, it's no DVDs. The other ones are, but not this one. But this one I got like one and a half week ago. Um, and I haven't opened it because I wanted to wait for all of the things to arrive. Um, so yeah, it's tempting to open these things, but um, yeah, um, but it's more fun to open them all at once. So anyway, um, some of these things, like I guess maybe half of these items, are Christmas gifts. Probably gonna buy a few more things, um, but. Um, I'm not gonna show you those, or maybe I will. I don't know. Well, um, I ordered these things from Amazon, or actually not all of them, but this one I did. Um, so let's start with this one. Actually, no. Let's start with this one because, well, I'll explain. I guess. Actually, <laughs> I am changing my mind all the time. I was gonna start with this one, and then I'll go with the big one. Uh, this one is, uh, uh, I can hold her, cover her face up because I don't know if she want to be on the internet. You, you're not going to be able to tell anyway who she, what she looks like. But my grandma gave me, she was here two days ago, I wasn't here, so I guess she left this for me. Christmas gift. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to open it now, but uh, I'm doing so. It was like laid out on my desk like, this is for you, you know. So I figured that it would be okay to open it now. Um, and uh, yeah, so I'm just gonna do that. Um, I thought that we, was, we were gonna celebrate Christmas with her. But uh, maybe we're not. before here. Um, I don't think you can see it if I hold it in my lap, but Okay, 
first uh, I got this for me because it was there and uh, I actually I was just I wasn't looking for this I was maybe a week ago or two weeks ago I um, I just sort of looked through I was looking at another Swedish TV series and then I found this one while I was doing that and it had the same people in it and um, I thought it was gonna be I mean it looked good so I looked if it was available on DVD and it was and then I didn't buy it but I just thought okay cool and then maybe a week later or something I, I, or a couple of days later or whatever I ordered this package and I got this from myself too it's a TV show Swedish comedy show called Passions Puff Perfumery and um, I don't know if it's gonna be any good but it's a comedy show from 1997 and uh, yeah. I'm looking over there all the time because you can clearly see in here and uh, it doesn't matter why but the elevator was open so I'm guessing somebody's there anyway uh, now these are all gifts. First, this one. This one is for my mom. I kind of want to see this too. But, um, well, this is for her Nip Tuck season one. She's been talking about this for a long time. I don't know why she doesn't get it for herself. Maybe she doesn't want it that much. I don't know. But uh, I figured it would be good to buy for her. Um, I, I order DVDs for everybody, I might explain, um, because like I, I don't know how personal I wanna, I wanna get, but basically one night I, this happens sometimes to me, I sort of just panic and um, I just start thinking about every, every possible little detail in my life that might be negative and I just, chaos, you know. Um, and I don't know, that just happens sometimes, I'm not afraid, I'm not, I don't, I don't want to hide it, it doesn't matter. But, um, so that happened, mainly because I wasn't sure what Christmas gifts to buy, and I just felt pressured, I don't know, it, it, maybe it makes no sense, but it doesn't need to. But, so I just figured, well, I've seen a lot of movies. If I ordered a DVD for everybody in um, in my family at over at my fam over at my dad's house, then maybe that would work out, and I won't feel pressured anymore, and I can feel good again. <laughs> so I did that right then, uh, right there. Uh, I just picked uh, a movie for everybody, or one movie each that I thought that would be appropriate for them. I don't know. Um, this one I was uh, was pretty good, but um, I think she might like it more than I did. The Legend of the Owls. Um, the Owls. I don't know. The Swedish title is on the cover, so. Uh, but I think you recognize the movie. Got that for. I thought that would be. I could change. It's not like they're it's, they're marked with their name. But I, I figured this will be for my <coughs> little sister <coughs> and a Christmas Carol with Jim Carrey for my brother. I like this one. Um, and then this movie I loved from last year. I think it's underrated. It's beautiful. Uh, by um, what's his name? Alejandro Gonzalez, no. Yeah, Gonzalez in Aritu. You know, you know, I don't know how to pronounce it, you know. So, um, but uh, I like this a lot. He's the director uh, of 21 Grams and Babel and Amores Peros, which I haven't seen, but that seems to be really good. That one is for my stepmom. I don't know if this is, maybe this is not an appropriate move to give to your stepmom. Maybe I'll switch it up. I don't remember 
if there were any um, explicit scenes in it, but um, I'm not going to be watching it with her anyway, so I don't know. <laughs> I'm just saying that maybe it would be awkward to give her that movie. I don't know, I can't remember, but I, I can remember that I loved the movie. Then I got a stand-up, I figured this would be for my dad. Um, Yuan Lance. I have this already, I bought this like two, three years ago. <laughs> um, but uh, I think he will find it funny too. Uh, World Tour of Skeone. So, um, yeah. And then lastly for my older sister, she doesn't really watch movies, but I got these from sort of the same offer and I just, I don't know, maybe she will uh, enjoy this. I don't know what kind of movie she likes. Maybe, uh, maybe this is not really what she likes to watch, but Little Miss Sunshine. Um, yeah, uh, she, 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 she has like a lot of DVDs herself, but it's all TV shows. Uh, anyway, I actually spent a lot of time with those. This one is interesting. It feels very light, as I said in the beginning, so probably it's gonna be of some cheap plastic material, but it wasn't too expensive. It's just a sort of fun joke gift for, for the whole family. If it will be actually used, I don't know, but it will be a, just a joke. Let's see exactly how cheap this is. Toxic gases, give it 10 minutes. The smell of a number two can sometimes be too much to take. This is why you should warn your family and friends of your toxic toilet habits with a caution cone. Let them see the contaminated zone before they take a lungful of your harmful fumes. Uh, this is... Um, what is this? What, I don't know what I was going to say. Not much to say about it, I guess. It speaks for itself. Um, and then three things for me. Uh, this one arrived today. It's the last thing I was waiting for. This package, maybe I've, op I've ordered from them before. Maybe it's several people do this. But these are a pain in the ass to open. Scissors, I think, because this is okay. Stupid pants keep falling off. Um, I'm very excited about this one. Um, it's um, a pretty 
pretty ugly. Oh, it seems to have a slip case and it's shiny. Well, that's a nice surprise. But still, it's not a great looking DVD. It's not that bad, but uh, yeah, so that's, that's two su good surprises that it's shiny and that it has a slip case. So, Marx Brothers TCML Turner Classic Movies Greatest Classic Films Collection is what it says. This one contains A Day at the Races, Room Service, A Night in Casablanca, and At the Circus. Uh, four Marx movies that I have not seen before. Um, so, yeah, this will be uh, a lot of fun to watch. Looking forward to especially A Day at the Races, which is supposed to be very funny. The other ones are funny too, um, I've heard. But um, especially A Day at the Races has uh, high ratings. Um, then these next, this that was from Amazon, and these two are also from Amazon. I uh, might just use the scissors here too. gonna be so much fun to check the other ones out. Seven movies in total. I think there was a more um, sort of proper set. Maybe it was a, maybe a nicer box set or, and maybe more special features. Maybe this ha doesn't have any. But um, I'm, I'm, I'm good with this one. Um, I don't know, do they become worse and worse as they go by? I, well, I mean, whatever. Um, either way, I'm gonna watch all of them because... Hope I'm not getting a cold again. I just had one. And the last thing, this is much thinner than I thought. Um, This uh, show is, I heard it's supposed to be very sort of over the top sexually maybe and uh, just in the way that people behave and whatever, someone compared it to Californication in that sense. Great cast, H Hank Azaria, Blythe Danner, Oliver Platt. I think that's his name. That's his name. Can you guess what show it is? Uh, the box it looks great. This, yeah. I'm gonna show it to you now. It's Huff season one. The bad thing about this is that um, I don't think season two is out on DVD. There's only two seasons. Uh, so if I end up liking this, which I'm sure I will, I'm gonna have to. Um, download the second season but uh, yeah this is rated 18 so it should be a fun watch it's about uh, I think uh, it's about Hank Azaria's character he I don't know uh, it's a family man and a successful psychiatrist uh, well anyway he, he um, gets a midlife crisis I think and uh, they did, did a show about that, so obviously stuff is gonna happen. <laughs> so yeah, it's it's gonna it's, it's yeah, it's, I'm, I'm gonna love this, I'm sure. So now I'm gonna show you what I talked about. It looks like Christmas, more or less. <laughs> and there's the 500 kroner in the plant. Um, 
So yeah, now I'm going to clean it up and watch the movies, or not all of them, because all of them are not for me. But um, yeah, okay, that's it. If you watched all of this, which, uh, which you probably did if you're listening to this, then well, thank you for taking time to watch me unbox movies and toxic gases warnings. Yeah. So, um, anyway, thank you for watching and um, see you after Christmas, I guess. Um, so, yeah, thank you and goodbye.